You see this big bag behind me? This is full, almost to the brim, full of Dollarama stuff from two trips, yesterday and today. So if you're interested to see what I got, then you're just gonna have to keep watching. Hey my little specs, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. I hope you become a member of our Spark family by pressing the subscribe button wherever it is on the device that you're watching this on. And also don't forget to hit that little bell icon that's just down beside the subscribe button so that way you'll get notified every time I upload a new video. So like I said at the beginning of the video, um, this big bag behind me is full to the brim. Like I can't even lift it. It's so, so heavy, um, full of the stuff. And it was from two shopping trips from yesterday and today. Today is July 8th. I don't know when this is going up, when you guys are going to see it, because I have other videos that are set to be um, scheduled for upload um, before this one is even being filmed. So I don't know when this one's going to go up, but it will go up soon, I promise. Um, but my sister Fiona is coming in from out of town tonight, and I need place to put her stuff for the weekend, so I want to get the stuff put away before she gets here tonight. And, uh, yeah, so anyways, you guys know you love my Dollarama hauls anyway, so it's all good. Um, but as you know, I don't take things out in any particular order. Um, just gonna pull out of the bag and let's see what we got. And I will show you the bag at the end of the video. You'll see how big this bag is. So the first thing I got is this dry food container with scoop. It's a 3.5 liter capacity. Um, I'm... I got this because I get um, cheese powder from uh, Bulk Barn to make homemade uh, craft dinner for my daughter um, because it, it comes out cheaper that way than to um, buy the actual boxes of craft dinner. And um, but yeah, so I need a container to put it in instead of keeping the bag from Bulk Barn. Um, so that's that, and this was three dollars. Then the next thing I got, I had to get it because anybody who knows me knows this is one of my favorite flowers. And it was also my friend Lorenzo's favorite flower who has passed away a long time ago, um, but it feels like just yesterday. So as soon as I saw this and it being July and the anniversary of his death is coming up, I was like, this is a sign. <laughs> I need to get this cup. I don't know if I'm going to use it to drink from or if I'm just going to use it for decoration, but I had to have it. And it was only $1.25. And it says patio plastic oil, um, BPA free, but it doesn't say if it's dishwasher or microwave safe. So I would, if you guys get this, I would suggest just hand washing it. But yeah, so that's that. Then I got for me. The other one's in there somewhere. I'll get it eventually. Um, because my daughter and I like to make our own iced coffees. And um, the cups that we currently use are really massive. And we're trying to start to get healthier. And um, so we're trying not to drink as much sweets and stuff like that. So when I saw these at Dollarama, I was like, oh, this is a perfect size for an iced coffee. It's not too big, not too small. It's just perfect. And these are also from the Patio Plastico brands. They're $3. And these are not dishwasher or microwave safe um, because it even shows it on the bottom there. Um, like I said, $3, uh, BPA free. And it comes with the straw and the lid. And it's, I want to say this is double thickness, like it's double lined. But I'm not 100% sure. But I think it is because this, this insert looks like paper. But the, And there's no way to get it out. So anyway. Um, so that's this one. I got this one for me because y'all know. If you know me personally, you know I'm like obsessed with flamingos. So there's that. Then um, for my daughter's room, I got... This uh, power strip with six grounded outlets, a circuit breaker, and it's uh, 1.5 feet, and it was $4, and it's by the Globe brand. So there's that. Then also for my daughter's room, because she's obsessed with LED lights for some reason, and my mom was telling me about this. 
so my daughter had to try it because you know grandma said it's good so it must be good it's by this electrica brand and it's this wireless led light and it's color changing and it comes with a remote and it also comes with the batteries um so yeah you manually turn it on or off by pressing it or you can use the remote and um i don't know how well this works my mom says it works pretty good um but we will try it and i shall let you know how it works but yeah so anyways um the back of the box says that the the I almost read it in French. Uh, the remote control, sorry, um, has 18 touches, uh, 18 keys. Oh, the English is right on top of it and I didn't even see it. Um, wireless control up to 15 feet away. So that's pretty good. My, my daughter can be in another room and bring the remote with her and turn it on. She wants to use this as a nightlight. So we'll see how that goes. Um, she doesn't even know that I have it. She's outside using her new skateboard that she got for her birthday. And um, so that's why I'm, I'm doing this video now without her here. So anyways, next, also for my daughter, because she's learning how to cook. And um, she wants to be able to cook stuff like shrimp and stuff like that. And I'm allergic to shrimp. So she asked me if I can get her her own pan to cook shrimp and to also make her eggs in the morning. So I found this eight inch nonstick fry pan for $4 um, by Betty Crocker. And it says cool touch handles, carbon steel and everything. And that should be good for her. So there's that. Okay, next I have there's a bunch of these. I think I got four packs um, for a DIY for my daughter's room. Um, these are the command sticks. Damage free hanging. Holds strongly. It holds up to one pound and there's two in each. Uh, these were $4 a pack and I got four packs of them. Yeah, four packs. So um, there's that. And then I got for myself this creative coloring 30 designs and eight metallic pencils um for four dollars i don't know what the designs look like inside hold on let me oh there's a tape here to open it here we go let me show you guys the inside it's on <laughs> come on you act like you don't know how to do youtube um see it's kind of like a gold design and it's on black paper and the paper is really thick and it's really pretty and it's like a metallic gold for the design and i'll do a, a flip through or whatever it's called soon but i just wanted to show you guys this like i said it's four dollars it's by the crafts brand and this was new to me so when i saw it i was like why not um oh yeah here's the one for my daughter this is the one that she chose it's got stripes and lemons on it so that's her cup for iced coffees then I got my daughter because I don't know if you guys noticed, but they started selling gift cards and like iTunes cards and Google Play cards and all that kind of stuff at, at Dollarama. So my daughter is obsessed with Roblox. And so she asked for a Roblox card to get her some Robux. And I got her a $25 Robux card um, as one of her birthday gifts as well. Then I got, because my mom keeps telling me, ow, my mom <laughs> keeps telling me that this is a very good um, popcorn flavor and everything. I've had Bad Monkey before, but I don't remember the flavor. I just know it had chocolate on it, but I don't remember what the exact flavor was. But anyways, um, this is the creme brulee flavor, and creme brulee caramel flavor. Um, my mom said it was really good and i can't remember the price of it hold on let me see is it in here no it's not yes it is no it's not um give me a second uh, no that was in yesterday's this that's today's bill anyway um i'm sure amanda because i know amanda you watch my videos all my dollarama hauls so how much is this i think i want to say two dollars or 250 but i don't remember and i can't find the receipt right now so anyways next i got three three packs oh, of these kogan 
um, 15 com compostable luncheon plates made with sugar cane. They're sustainable and renewable. They're heat and soak resistant, microwave safe, freezer safe. They're nine inches and there's 15 in each. And these were $3.50 a pack. And I got three packs of them because in the summer, you know, sometimes we just like to have salads or, or sandwiches or whatever. And who really wants to do dishes in the middle of summer when, you know, whatever. So I also got three packs. Aha, here we go. Three packs of the um, Kogan compost. Com can't even talk anymore. Compostable bowls. There's 15 in them. And they're also 350. Call me lazy if you want. But I mean, hey. If it like makes life easier, why not, right? Um, and then I got a... I know there's two of them in here. Haha, -ha, here we go. Um, two packs of these. These are a repurchase. You guys know every time I go to Dollarama, I buy these because I use them quite often. We use them for my iPad, my daughter's iPad, my phone, her phone. I use them for my glasses. I use them for my monitors and stuff like that. So these are really good. And remember, there's 20 in here and they're $1.25. Okay, so next in the bag for my rabbits for the girls, because I bought them, if you remember, a couple dollar Emma hauls ago, I bought them a small little um, dish for their water, but it doesn't hold very much and they keep flowing it all over the place. And I saw this one. This one is a lot heavier and it's deeper, as you can see. And it's three fifty, and it means pink for the girls. So I had to get that. And then I got for my daughter's phone because she accidentally throws them around a lot. Um, these Tech One tempered glass HD screen protectors for two fifty each, and I got two of them. Um, then I got for myself this. 170 gram bag of Doritos, the original nacho cheese flavor, and this was $2.50. I'm sorry guys, I had to put this on the floor. Um, let me know in the comment section below if the audio is okay, um, because I have my fan going, and there's kids outside because I have my window open, and there's kids outside playing, and it's just summer, hot, need air, so yeah. But anyway, continuing on, I've got these Fluffs brand um cotton pads 100 percent pure cotton there's a hundred cotton rounds in here for a dollar 25 and they're in a resealable bag i use these for like um besides removing makeup i also use these for like uh nail polish removing nail polish um okay what's next then here we go i got some nail clipper with rubberized handle uh with stainless steel head these are the ones like they use in this in the salons and if you can see um they uh are good for clipping like around the cuticle and stuff like that because my daughter has a habit of picking at her nails really badly and um right at the moment near her cuticle there's some skin that's really really bad and my nail clippers just is not grabbing it so when i saw this i was like yeah i have to have this and that i think i bought that today did i uh give me a second give me a second give me a second do 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 no apparently i didn't that was in yesterday's thing so i don't remember how much this one is because i don't know where i put the receipt from yesterday um but yeah i think these were four dollars but i'm not 100 percent sure anyways there's more of the command strips and i just realized i only bought eight and i need 16 so I'm going to have to go back to Dollarama sometime this weekend and get more. Um, anyways. Next is also a repurchase. I got these Top top Taste. Oh, that's the brand. Okay. Top Taste Crispy Fried Onions. 100 grams in each one. They were a dollar. Give me a second. These ones I know I bought today. There we go. A dollar 25 and these are really really good they taste just the same as the um actually i find them better than the french's uh fried onions that you put on top of like salad and whatever they're really really good then i got for my bubble baths 
I got the Spa Viva Epsom Salt Crystals in Lavender and it's 454 grams and this was $1.50. This is a repurchase. I always have to have this in my house because it really helps with my back. Um, what's next? I got, I had to have this because like I said at the beginning of the video, like I always say, you guys know I'm obsessed with flamingos. So when I saw this when I was walking down the down the the summer aisle, <laughs> I was like, yeah, I have to have it just just because. Um, it's an ice cube set, eighteen pieces of of um, like those reusable ice cubes, dollar twenty five, and look, they're flamingo shaped. They're so cool. I saw that and I was like, yeah, I have to have it. Um, so anyways. Next, I got myself this Starbucks Double Shot Energy and Coffee in the flavor Mocha. Um, 444 milliliters, 200 calories per can. And we're not going to get into the rest of the stuff. I bought this specifically for the caffeine. And I know I shouldn't be drinking this, but we're not going to sell anything. Anyway. And for my phone, another Tech One um, brand. I bought this uh, screen cleaner. It's got a spray bottle and it's refillable. And it's got a microfiber cloth. And it looks like a square like this, as you can see. And this is $250. Um, but yeah, I, th I thought that was really cool. When I saw that, I had to have it. Then my daughter asked if she can have this. It's kind of kind of summery, as you can see. It's a um, studio brand, $1.25. It's 200 pages. And let's see the inside. It has that little snap as you just heard me open. So it stays closed. And it's lined. You guys can see. So that's for my daughter. And she also asked because she, she's big on like aesthetic stuff now. And so she saw this and she had to have it. It's a light up terrarium. Um, uses two batteries. I don't know how this thing turns on, but I honestly, I think the batteries are dead because I'm pressing the buttons and it's not working. So anyways, this is it. It's really, really pretty and it's heavy too. Um, not sure how much this was because I don't see the price. I'm imagining something this heavy was probably $4, but who knows? Um, anyway, so I'm going to have to get batteries for that. Then I got... The Sweet Shop for $1.25, uh, 190 grams, fruit flavors, sour jelly beans. Then I got, because my daughter's best friend bought her some of these for her birthday last week. And I tried some and they're absolutely addicting. Uh, my favorite flavors in here are the mango and the golden apple pineapple but they also have lime and fruit punch but yeah jolly ranchers and the, they're like i think there were two or 250 something like that and there's 198 grams in here i don't know exactly how many pieces but yeah so i bought two of those then i bought um a repeat i guess you could call it these 100 plus 20 yards more uh aim mint wax dental floss for a dollar fifty and that's the one I bought two of them then I got a repurchase because you know how much my daughter loves these it's 12 of these uh bowl full chicken flavor instant ramen noodles they're four for a dollar and I mean they're easy to make so why not um but yeah so I got 12 of these. I'm not going to show you all 12 because, you know. But yeah. Then I got four of these country prime meats, dry pepperoni sticks in the honey garlic flavor. They're 40 grams. Let me show you. See, that's that. That's the pepperoni stick. Um, I believe they're $1.25 each or $1.50 each, something like that but they are so worth it this honey garlic flavor is so good i've never tried this um brand before until my last dollarama um 
shopping trip and obviously I didn't film it because it was just like a spur of the moment thing. Um, and these are gluten free and lactose free. So that's good. No nitrates, preservative free and everything. No fillers. So these are pretty much, I guess you could say these are healthy. I mean, I don't see any nutritional nothing on it, but I mean, oh, for nutritional information, you can go to the website, but um, the ingredients, there's not even anything that I can't pronounce. You know how some stuff you can't pronounce certain things? The ingredients is pork, waters, uh, pork, water, sugars, honey, and cane sugar. Spices, sea salt, garlic, mustard, cultured celery powder, and smoke. That's it. That's all. That's, that's all it has for the ingredients. So these are really good. And I think that's about it. Hold on, hold on. Let me see. Just got to make sure. Okay. So there's another one of those things. I told you I got four packs. Then my daughter also wanted, because she thought these were very aesthetic. Um, tell you, my daughter's big into this whole aesthetic thing lately. But yeah, by Home Deco, it was $1.25. And it's this little itty bitty jar of shells. You see it? She just wants it for decoration for her room. I asked her if she was going to open it. She said, nope, I'm just going to leave it on my desk for decoration. So that's that. I mean, I couldn't say no to her. It was only $1.25. You know what I mean? And the last thing, which everything went inside it, was for $4. It's this extra large tote bag. Um, see, see how big it is? It's huge. And it says, in French, it says, Nathan de Megazine. <laughs> and in English, I guess the translation would be, it's time to, it doesn't even translate into English properly. Like, it's supposed to be, it's time for shopping, but instead of, because Megazine is spelt with M A. Uh, M A G A blah 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 whatever, but they put it to magazine, so it's like mega shopping, I guess. It it kind of doesn't make any sense in 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 English once you translate it, but that's what it means. And so yeah, that's the end of my Dollarama haul. Um, is there anything? No, that's it. Yeah. Um. So yeah, I'm gonna go put this stuff away. Let me know in the comment section. Um, have you ever tried this guy? And if you have, what do you think of it? Um, and uh, I think that's it. But I mean, honestly, how cute are these little um, flamingo ice cubes? I can't wait to put them in the freezer and use them. They're so adorable. But all right, I'm going to go give my daughter her, her things, especially the surprise that I got for her. And um, yeah, so let me know. Oh. Let me know if you guys have tried this flavor popcorn and if it was any good. Or is my mom lying? Uh, <laughs> no, she's not lying. I mean, everybody has their own opinion, right? But anyways, um, that's it. I'm going to go. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up because it really does help. And I appreciate it more than you guys even know. Um, and like I said at the beginning of the video, if you are not yet subscribed, please do so and become a member of our Spark family. It would mean the world to me. Um... I try my best to upload as often as possible. Sometimes life gets in the way and, you know, things happen and whatever. But I try my best. And so that's it. So follow me on all my socials. The, they're all linked below in the, in the um, I was going to say comments, in the description box below. And uh, that's it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.